You're tired, man. Oh, it's a dodo! <laughs> First one of the season. Beautiful. Beautiful. All right, keep going left. Keep going left. Keep your rides up high. Keep coming left, guys. Here we go, Stevie. How are you doing, Nicky? Keep going left. All right, guys. Fish of the day for me. Took a long run out there. Had a half dead sardine belly hooked. Ran out quite a ways. Just picked up and ran and ran and ran. Kicked it into the lower gear. So now we're just kind of worth wearing him down. Coming over. Very nice fish. Nice job, Ernie. Yeah. Well, right now we're about 125 miles offshore. We're just drifting. The skipper found a meter mark last night and uh, kind of stayed in the area. First light, we got baits in the water and we started getting bit pretty quick. This is Jim, he's on a fish. And just watch his technique, he does a good job. He's just, every time he lowers the rod tip, he's turning the handle. See how he uses the rod and the reel to gain line. So he's going to pick up the rod and he gets to a point where he's got a nice bend in the rod. And then when he gets the head turned a little bit, then he he's drops the rod tip and he cranks on it. That's exactly how you wind on a fish. It doesn't matter if it's a bluefin tuna like what we're hooked on now, a marlin or even a rainbow trout. It's all the same technique. It's all about using the rod tip correctly so it beats up the fish and then use the drag on the reel to like slow the fish down or kill the fish. And that's what he's doing here. He's been around the boat a few times. Must be a nice sized tuna. But this is a technique you want to do. You don't want to be turning the handle while you're lifting the rod. You don't want to be dropping the rod down and then trying to turn the handle. You just want to do it just like that. Nice and easy, constant pull. Just take your time. We're not going anywhere until he gets that fish in. And that's what you do. The other key to this type of fishing too, that's what you do once you got the fish hook. The big key though is to be changing your bait all the time. You want to have a good fresh bait out there away from the boat. These bluefin tuna are real finicky, so we're using some fluorocarbon too. So just get that bait away from the boat a little bit, good lively bait. And once you hook it, you fight it like Jim, and uh, you should end up with some fresh sashimi right after that. All right, we're gonna take a little break from the action here, go to the tackle box give you a good look at the gear we're using for today's fishing. <laughs> 